What's up guys, Versatile Element here, and it's the first Friday of the new year and of the new decade, so let's talk PlayStation. Skinner Bop and Dada! So for my first ever PlayStation review, I was in like a review for something related to PlayStation, here I have in front of me is this uh, Paladone, or Aladone, excuse me, Aladone or Paladone PlayStation Symbolite, or not, not rather Symbolite, but the controller, excuse me, a controller light. Although I do remember seeing at a local Think Geek this, uh, this really cool PlayStation Symbolite with triangle, square, circle, and X, or cross as Sony likes to call it officially, but, but we fans will keep on calling it X anyways, I would love to get that uh, that PlayStation symbol lights. I do believe that a uh, YouTuber Cryptic Element got it as a Christmas present recently, but hey, this is a good start, you know, it's a good start to that. This is the PlayStation symbol light, the controller light, why are you even saying controller light, uh, symbol light, it's controller light, PlayStation controller light made by Aladone, is that how you pronounce it? I'm not sure. This is how the box looks like. Got this as a gift from uh, from my local, not really my local Think Geek that gave it to me. Now it was bought at my local Think Geek. Got it as a gift yesterday. As we as we're filming this, it's controller light, and as you can see, official licensed product for by PlayStation, and it looks like BDP, I guess. BDP. Uh, this uh, this symbol light does show does require. Three AAA, two AAA battery. What am I saying now? Two AAA batteries to to have it light up. And even though, unlike Funko Pops, it says collect them all, and apparently this is product number 001, 001 it, uh, the box doesn't show any other of the collectibles in this series. So that's unlike Funko Pops. But here we go. Let's try to get this this review going uh, much better. At least try it to. This is this controller light was modeled after the original dual analog sticks for the PlayStation One. The dual analog controller that is. This is before the analog sticks were added. The left and right thumbsticks. So this is the dual analog controller. And, and uh, yeah, this is the original controller that the PlayStation was released back at, with back in the early to mid 90s, I believe, 1993, 1994, 1995-ish. Don't you see the buttons? Do does seem to feel good. <laughs> Select, start. It has. It really does look like an original Sony PlayStation controller, and it's standing on a. Um, on a platform, you see the PlayStation logo right here, and PlayStation symbol logo, and then the PlayStation PlayStation spelled out logo. You press this button, and here you go. That's how the symbol light goes. How how it looks like it's how it looks like lit up. I believe. <laughs> yeah. What am I saying? I'm doing. I'm just saying this stuff as we keep going. So. Yes, and this is also, I found a solution so I don't have to make this type of review video with uh, just handheld, you know. I, I found a little improvement this time over my other Funko Pop reviews. Which, speaking of which, is going to be the next. I'm going to have a Funko Pop review for the next um, video coming up as after you see this. Again, so this is how the, the controller light looks like, lit up. It can it can be like uh, I I say that this can be a re, uh, very nice uh, f uh, amusing looking uh, a piece of collectible PlayStation collectible for your room your control your con not control setup but your gaming setup or entertainment setup maybe a night light for uh, for when it's nighttime yeah perhaps. So let's go test this out for a little bit. Let's let's see a little bit of this in action. Here's a little test action, a little test. Just playing a little bit of Fortnite on my place with my PlayStation symbol lights, and as and as you can see, uh, it really does feel feel comfortable. It really does feel like play, like uh, holding a real PlayStation controller in your hand, just a tiny version of one, and like the buttons are really responsive, although on. Uh, on screen, as you can see right now, no, it's not that my controller is lagging. It's more like the uh, gameplay is a uh, 
gameplay itself is lagging. So it's not the controller, it's the game. Go blame the game, not the controller. So that's just been my pretty uh, short review of this Paladone, excuse me. I looked at the box, at the box, at the bottom of the box. The Paladone PlayStation icon uh, controller light. And so it looks like a really, it looks like a, an amusing gift, like I said. A, a amusing piece of uh, decoration, a piece of collectible for your bedroom, your your desk setup, gaming setup, whatever you'd like to use this for. Maybe a nightlight. So I don't know how much this costed back. This costed at my local Think Geek again since I had this as a gift. Since I got this as a gift. But anyways, I I I recommend uh, trying it out. You know, if you if you like to collect these type of things, I think since last summer I'm starting to become a a, a, a begin to become a collector. And oh yeah, there's another th one more uh, item that uh, one more detail that I forgot to show you is that instead of L1, L2, R1, R2, it's just one, two, and one and two, <laughs> and. It's sort of, it's almost transparent, kind of, almost transparent or translucent, and you probably can't see it on the, on the, on video itself, but you can see, but um, I could see a little bit of wires, especially, especially if you, if, if this, the symbol I just uh, turned on, but okay, that's, and that's all for now, really. All that I have for this symbol light review, this icon controller light review, the controller light review, excuse me. So if you do like this uh, this product, see if you can nab it at at your local GameStop, ThinkGeek, maybe Target or whatever. If you can find it, if you, especially if you like PlayStation and just gaming in general. If you are an Xbox guy, which I am not that much of, I'm more of a PlayStation guy as uh, as you can see. I did see at my local ThinkGeek that they had like a new, at least new to me, uh, Xbox symbol light. Just Xbox logo symbol light, either for the 360 or or most likely the Xbox One. So I think you should be able to uh, get that if you're an Xbox fan. But anyways, guys, this is all for now for this PlayStation controller light review. Feel free to like, favorite, comment, subscribe, and let me know what you think of this uh, this controller light. Versatile Elements signing out, and I'll keep on getting better and better with these reviews as time goes on. And I'll see you in the next one.